It was a drama-filled weekend for Liberty Softball as they welcomed in the first place Coastal Carolina Shawna Clears on Friday night. Coastal won game one of the series 4-3, but Liberty bounced back with a doubleheader sweep on Saturday, winning both games 5-4. The difference in game two came from freshman Cassie Gingrich on her birthday, who delivered a game-winning clutch squeeze bunt in the bottom of the 10th as Liberty won 5-4. We caught up with head coach Dow Richardson in the Flames after the series win on Saturday. It's kind of fun when you look and say, here's a birthday girl. So Cassie Gingrich gets up, one of the best spunners on our team. And we didn't go with the first pitch. We went the second, knowing it'd have a little surprise factor. And it, what was really special, um, I don't know if you talked about it, but for Mickey Leverage, who's been out with an injury, wrapped up, you know, we made sure the umpire said she could get out there to run for Matikachi in the extra innings. And uh, she was, I think nothing was going to stop her from scoring. So... It was a beautiful win, a beautiful game, and this is why we love it. And what you're seeing is a team that's believing. They're removing all doubt. They're believing in the gifts that God has given them, and they're just, like Cassie said, uh, just enjoying it. And it's fun to watch because we're, we're starting to peak at a really great time. Uh, senior day, extra innings, everything. It's rivalry, like all of that just makes an awesome environment. It makes an awesome feel. Like the team was just in it. You could just feel, feel the energy from everybody, and that was really cool. I'm still shaking. Like I'm just so excited. I'm so proud of the girls, and we just came out ready, especially for the seniors. I'm like gripping my water bottle, and as soon as she got that bunt down, I threw my, wa my water bottle and just ran out. Like that play like, that we had was amazing. I was almost the first base, and Coach Norman put her hands up, and then I heard the crowd, and after that, it's kind of a blur, but yeah, everyone mobbed me. It was so exciting. We'd, we'd never give up. Our pitchers threw incredibly today. Um, each pitch they were in it, each pitch everyone was in it. It was just a team sport. Uh, before the game, Coach Cassie said, with players being injured, everyone had to step up and had to win this, make it a team win, and so it was incredible. Coastal's definitely one of the better teams we've played this year. They're always they're always up there for competition level. It's you know kind of a big rivalry game. Everybody comes out with their beat Coastal T-shirts on, so it's you know like it's an exciting adrenaline going game for sure. Every time we stepped it up this weekend for sure, it was a big step. That's awesome to see like people like Cassidy McCoy, Maddie Kachi, and like Cassie step up and make it happen. So that was really cool. Oh, our pitchers they did an awesome job. We have a really great battery going right now. They're just. They're just studs, they're just killing it, and I'm so proud of them. We never give up, never. We have a fighting mentality, and we go until the end. We go until that last out, we go until that last batter hits a home run, gets that other girl in, like, we just keep fighting. We never give up. Liberty will take their momentum into next week as they continue their season-long nine-game homestand, welcoming in the Hampton Pirates for a doubleheader on Tuesday. With the Flames in Lynchburg, I'm Alan York for the Liberty Flames Sports Network.